Hi guys, thank you for watching Edupedia World videos. In this session of sales report, we'll see sales analysis report, customers tab. Sales analysis report provides you an in-depth information about sales volume achieved with the customers through your business. This report helps you to analyze which of the customers have paid highest prices for your product, which other customers are proving to be profitable for your business. What are the products that you manufacture are most successful within the market and which of the your sales employee are giving their best for the sales this report gives you a graphical display and that display helps any salesperson to get an in-depth knowledge of the sales trend that has been there in the past year or the past month or the past quarter sales analysis report is found in sales module sales report as sales analysis there are three tabs customer items and sales employee by customer tabs you can analyze the sales volume for each customer or for customer groups by items tab you can analyze the sales volume either by an item or by an item group by sales employee tab you can analyze the sales volume per sales employee each of these tabs have different selection parameters and they give a different report structure as well. Let's see about the different selection criteria. We'll see about the customers tab. There is the time range. You can run your report on annual basis or monthly report or quarterly report. There are documents that you want to involve. Display, how do you want it? Individual or group display. Individual display displays the roof for individual customers. And group display displays the report for the customers group with each customer group appearing in a separate row. There are date range as well. Posting date, due date, document date. You can select the customer range and you can choose to display the amount in system currency. Let's run the report and first selection criteria I have taken here annual report, invoices as my document and individual display as my display parameter. You can see here that it gives me sales analysis by customer and annual report. I can drill down any of these customer by clicking on this golden arrow here you can see that there is a row that has total of all the columns what I can do I can simply click on this small graph here gives me a screen that has a graphical display here you can see say for the line number one the total gross profit is eighteen thousand six seventy dollar and you can see here in the range that the bar is touching that eighteen thousand six hundred dollar there is a small button here settings I can simply click on the settings and it gives me a couple of settings there is a graph type that you can select a suitable graph type number of rows that you want to be displayed within the report you can choose to display legions detail as well you can choose the elements that you want to include in the report like AR invoice total AR invoice gross profit gross profit percentage or total open invoice What I have done, I have selected all the elements and here is our report. You can see all the elements are appearing here. If I will choose not to display the legions, there will be no information here. Only the graph will be there. This is the line graph. Display of the same graphical representation. This is a draw line graph. You can see here that there are some solid points here. There is a spline graph and the pie chart. The limitation of the pie chart is that you can include only one element at a time.
now by clicking on any of the customer line for example I have taken Technosys and I, when I double click on this line it gives me another report it opens me a report that has all the documents that has dates it has the customer it has the sales amount applied upon gross profit and profit percentage what this report has it has two graph here what I can do I can print this report without these graphical representations it will be a simple report like this or I can check on this print diagram and I can print this report with graphical representations let's take another selection parameter annual report document as invoice and display as group display what I can do here I can simply click on any of these line and it will give me another report you can see here that the report has been now split into different group codes large account distributor small accounts now in SAP you can define these customer group according to your convenience again there is a row of all the totals I click on 103 and it gives me this report what I can do here again I can simply choose to print the diagram or not to print the diagram and here one thing you can see that these customers they fall within the group code of 103 that's why they are showing here this is the report without the graphical diagram and this is the report including those diagrams let's continue with another selection parameter I have taken monthly report orders and group display you can see here that the sales analysis by customer group is like this you can see that there is customer code customer group and it is giving me monthly January February March and so on again double clicking on any of the line item it will give me this thing you can see on here that there are the options how do you want to display this diagram here so I have taken draw light diagram as my option again I can choose to print without these diagram or I can choose to print with those diagrams let's see another selection parameter quarterly report sales order and individual displays here you can see that there is quarter 1 quarter 2 and quarter 3 and so on again I can choose the display of the diagram in the next session we'll see the sales analysis report but with item tabs thank you